weather on the A's with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Hi everyone, 638 right now. It is opening night for the Denver Fair in Lancaster County. Let's take a look at your forecast for this evening. We have uh, $15 per person rides from 6 p.m. to close. They're crowning Miss Denver Fair. We have the Super Candy Scramble as well. That sounds good. Baked goods auction in the swine show tonight. Temperatures will be in the 70s with mostly cloudy skies, breezy and cool conditions, but a nice night for the fair. Let's check out the News 8 Storm Team forecast today. Going with mainly cloudy, cool conditions. A little patchy drizzle around, especially this morning. And a little bit later this afternoon, that's possible too. 72 to 76 for your temperature range. For tonight, mostly cloudy, comfortable temperatures in the lower 60s. And then tomorrow we'll do 80s possibly here as we get more sunshine in the forecast. So tomorrow will be the sunnier day of the work week. We cloud it right back up on Thursday and bring in some rain. Right now in York, 64 degrees, overcast skies. Dew point is 59, winds out of the northeast at 5, so we still have that persistent easterly flow, which has really packed in the clouds for us this morning. Current temperature check elsewhere, reading in at 62 in Chambersburg, 63 for Lebanon, 60 in Sealands Grove, as well as Coatesville, you're at 63 degrees. Live on Super Doppler 8, I've been tracking some isolated showers, sprinkles, batchy drizzle, if you will. All of this is lifting up to the north. Really light stuff this morning west of the river. For the afternoon, still won't rule out the chance of sprinkles, especially as long as we have this easterly flow and that low deck of clouds in place. All of this developing around low pressure, which is stationed off the east coast. This area of low pressure is uh, churning, bringing a lot of rain to the mid-Atlantic, but for us, we miss out on that rain. We only get clouds and some patchy drizzle. So here's what the predictor shows us today. Low pressure starts to pull away, moves out to sea, and I think that will eventually help to clear us out late tonight and throughout the day tomorrow. So tomorrow is going to be a partly cloudy to mostly sunny day for us before clouds roll right back in here ahead of a cold front on Thursday. Now, Thursday, this front means business. It's going to come in in the afternoon and evening. Could touch off some gusty winds for us as well as brief heavy rain as it arrives Thursday evening. First pitch forecast for the barnstormers. Both barnstormers and revs are home tonight. We have temperatures right around 70 degrees with mostly cloudy skies, cool conditions, and it is T-shirt Tuesday at the barnstormers tonight. Check out the extended forecast from 74 today, jumping to 80 with more sun tomorrow, then 84 ahead of that cold front on Thursday, your warmest day of the week. Behind the front, we drop down to 74 Friday, breezy conditions, 70, that's it, on Saturday and 72 on Sunday. So a nice, cool, crisp, fall-like weekend mm -hmm. coming yeah, up. I Football Friday is going to be a cool one, too. You know, any outdoor activities you have planned for the end of the week? Little jacket might be in order. Well, yeah, most of the day on Saturday is going to be in the 60s. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. Yeah. cold by my standards. <laughs> you know me, I'm always cold. Me too. Yeah. All right. All right, Christine. Thanks. Thank you, Christine.